making a video. My first video um, goes collectibles and fishing. I love fishing. I love this. I'll show you one of the fish that I caught. Um, at the end of the video, we're going to be making a little bit of a Funko haul. I have some more over there. And yeah. So, this is our first video with our shelf. So, this is this. Rick also just lets you know I keep all the boxes for these. I just have some of them out on this way. This is my Rick, uh, Funnel Hat Rick Target Exclusive. It's a pretty sick pop. I like it a lot, and I just need to go back. Next, we got this. And a SpongeBob. And the SpongeBob. He's pretty cool. Um, I got it from a trade for my friend who's making a channel. I'll shout it out. I don't know what the name is going to be, but pretty sick. Um, I really like this pop, and yeah. Next we have this first order snow trooper. This is my first ever pop. It's actually quite cool. Um, it's a bobblehead. I don't really know what else to say about it, but it's a pretty cool pop. Next we have this Lando cow here. I don't, know, I don't I'm not really excited Star Wars anymore. I'm really into it. And, excuse me, I think this was a very cool pop. Next, we have um, some Duck Dodgers. It's Space Cadet. I don't like Porky Pig. He's really cool. Got another trade with this, but I traded two mini Funkos and nothing else. Next, we have this Love Ranger pop. I got it for like a dollar from like this one comic store because it was on sale, and I was like, I might as well pick it up. Right, that was one of my second Funko Pops. Next, we have this Spartan from Halo. Pretty cool pop. Not my favorite, but it's still a really sick pop. Um, yep. Just to let you guys know, I do collect other pops or other Funko products too. You'll probably see that soon um, at the end, but yeah. Next, we got this Baby Yoda. I'm the big, I'm a really big fan of this pop. Right for Christmas one year, or last year, I guess. I don't really know. But it is a very cool pop. Um, Mandalorian, it's a good show. I have to say. Next, we got this loot armor, which I'm going to be trading for a flocked, um, what's the one? I'm trying to think of his name. Sylvester. Flocked Sylvester for this. And, yeah. Next, we have the Softness Prime. I'm pretty sure it's $22 on the Funko app. Also, I recommend you download that. I'm not sponsored in any way, but download the Funko app because it's sick. It tells you all the prices of your pops. I like it. Very cool. Tom Riddle. Um, Cool pop. If not, it's just a good man. I was really into Legos at a time. And yeah. And also, Pokemon videos are going to come soon. But my local stores have not been carrying Pokemon. They're going to be back soon though. And this Tom Riddle, I don't care about Harry Potter anymore. I'll be completely honest with you. I do not care at all. I just don't. And yeah. So, next is the Slabion Bell from the New York Jets. Pretty sick pop. Um, I like it. And yeah. Next, we have this right here. This Peep Pop. I'm pretty sure it's $22 or something. I do think it's a very cool pop. These are my boxes, except for this one. We'll start out with this one then. These are also some New York Jets cards that I really like. They're all pretty rare. $22.99, stuff like that. And there might be a jersey card. Yeah, here's a jersey card. Pretty cool. And we have this one right here. This Deadpool. Or not Deadpool, sorry. There's a Deadpool box right over here. Um, this fight scene from Star Wars. Cool pop. I might be trading it soon for some stuff. I'll tell you if I do. And I guess we'll start out right here. So we have this Space Jam Bugs. Cool pop. I picked it up with this mini bugs. I'm bald. I'm just going to let you guys know. My favorite movie of the year Space Jam New Legacy. Great movie. Next, this row, we have. Deadpool, Barista Deadpool, pretty cool pop. I got it the same day as these. And I'm gonna let you guys know we are gonna be making, well, not we are, I am, but I'm gonna be making some Funko Pop shopping videos. And yeah, so that's what this one is from. I got it with these. Otter Pop. This, you'll probably know, this is the god of all Funko Pops, in my opinion. This Otter Pop is, or this Taz, which we'll get to in a second. I love this pop. I don't know why. I just love this pop. My friend, who I will comment down below his name, 
I guess he hasn't made his account yet, but he also bought one. And yeah, next we have the Sophia from Golden Girls. Shows a epic show. It's a great show. Wait, um, I forgot some shit. But it's Diamond Collection, FI exclusive. I personally really like this pop. Um, I just think it's a really nice pop. And yeah. Next, oh, actually bottom row, we have Rainbow Unicorn. I got from a trade who, from a friend who I will also comment down below because I don't know his username yet. Um, it's Rainbow Unicorn from Disney. He's a really cool pop, or she, I'm not really sure, but sick pop, one of my faves. Next, well, we're gonna go with this row down because they're not as exciting as the top row. This Frontline Heroes I got for two dollars at this one store. I don't remember where it was, but I got it for cheap. Cool pop, and I think it's gonna help us all remember this Corona outbreak. Am I even allowed to say it? Well, I'm not sure, but well, okay. Next, we got this Battle Hounds E3 2019 edition. Cross special needs to help me got Minty Axe. I have Minty Axe on my Fortnite account. And when I got this, yeah. Next, also, um, yeah, I have this Kona Mustard Clue figure. It's Target Kona exclusive. Got that for cheap. Not really sure why, but it was cheap. Yeah. And you know what? Before we get to the other top row shelves, which are some really sick pops, we're going to go down here for my other Funko products. These are some mystery minis. We have, this is by Funko. I'm not really sure what they are called. I don't remember. But those are really cool. I got some more mystery minis. And yeah, one more thing I want to show off. These Funko shot glasses are pretty cool. And this Doom Eternal, uh, Doom Slayer, Doom Recorn pop. Or not pop, uh, action figure. I very personally like this. And it's one of my favorite uh, figures. I, well, not pop figures, but just favorite action figures of all times. Today, or well, yeah, today I got the, these two right here. This Marvin the Martian from GameStop and this Bulbasaur from this one comic shop. And I think it's really cool. It's silver and stuff. It's just a really sick pop and I really like it. Next, make it or Marvin the Martian. Cool pop, got it from GameStop. I like it. Um, uh, and my dad helped me, he gave me an extra four dollars so I could buy it. Thank you, shout out to you. Um, I love this pop so much. It's just a really sick pop. Next, for the final pop on this side, I have five more over there. There's my not as cool one, so I have them on my not as cool shelf. And yep, this is this Flox Walmart Edition Taz. I love this pop. I got it when I was on vacation, and it means a lot to me. So that's these yeah, ones. Pop collection. Sorry, this is a little dark, but I also have this Hot Wheels, this little mini nether east. Eve. I traded a few of them. I traded Black Panther and something else. These are all my minis. I'm not going to take a bunch of time to go over them because it's going to take a little while. So, going up, we have this not Triceratops. It looks like her. It was this one I got from like a Capcom versus Marvel Pop. Sorry about that dust. I really have the dust. Oh god. Um, yep. Next, these two Harry Potter pops. So pretty cool pops. I just am not the biggest fan of Harry Potter anymore, so I mean, yeah. I got another Harry Potter pop right here. And we have this one guard for like, I don't remember actually. Or what's the one? The. I, I actually don't. Job of the Hut, like the Palace guards. That's what that is. Um, and that's my last pop. Here's the Star Wars thing. And also in the middle of this video. Or probably towards the end, I'm gonna show you my catch of the week. So each week, I'm gonna have a catch of the week. Um, it's a really sick catch, and I'm pretty sure you guys are gonna like it. 